Oh dear. Look what's happened to my old plate. The wind blew it off last night. I think that's a sign. It's the stair. And then he choked on it. Oh god, that's disgusting. Look. See that? That flew into my mouth and came out again. Where's the where's the other half of it? If that's just the wing. Oh shit, I haven't sorted it. <coughs> right, hello everyone. Welcome to another one of my videos. <laughs> yeah, sorry I haven't been around for a while. Uh, I haven't been up to much. I've just sort of been a bit lazy. Um, I have I had computer problems. And my laptop decided to crash on me, and I didn't know what to do. So I re reinstalled Windows XP, and uh, I had quite a lot of footage from a weekend uh, I had with Honda Boy CBS. He came up to see me. Uh, for those who don't know, he's my brother. Uh, I had quite a lot of footage, and I forgot to take the footage off my laptop before I reinstalled Windows. Oh, that's the boring stuff out of the way. Did any of you miss me? Right. Okay, I'll take that as a no then. As you see from my little bit of an intro, my L-plate uh, got blown off by the wind. Yes, it got blown off by the wind. <laughs> now if you believe that, you believe anything. But it did, it happened. I was going down the road, and it was like at a funny angle, like this. It's like, for those who don't know, my old plate's down by my um, my forks. Fucking how much room do you want, you knobhead? Um, yes, it, it sort of um, it was dangling. I thought, sorry, I'm gonna rip it off. So it could be a sign. There could be a sign that I need to do my bite test. Could be could be a sign. Oh, hello, I'm on camera. And, um, that Japanese man that took a photograph of me. Thank you! <laughs> Why did he do that for? I was going to give way to him. I've just come to Wix, so I need to get some nuts and bolts. I've lost my nuts and bolts. Um, yeah, no, I <laughs> oh god, I'm going to get run over by a van. Let's just park here, shall we? We'll park here. Yeah, let's park here. That'd do. Let's just watch the people go by. <laughs> oh, one day. We're all going to get old, aren't we? Anyway, yeah, I'm sitting here. I'm just trying. <laughs> I thought, now, I started doing a vlog, and I thought, no. I don't like it, and the wind was getting up. Oh, my trousers! And um, I thought I'd come in and just sit here for a bit, just get out the wind. So I've got to go <coughs> and get another L plate because I'm sure it's um, it's a legal requirement to have two. So if you let me know if it's a legal requirement to have it on the front and the back, because at the moment I feel like a bit of a rebel riding around without. Riding around with just one L plate. Um, I'm sure you'll tell me. Well, I'm trying to keep out the wind, as I keep saying about the bloody wind, because, uh, you know, going over certain miles an hour, uh, the wind just gets tremendous. So you have to bear with me with this one. I'm going to have to go on the uh, on the ring road to get to a, a nice quiet spot. Watching those old people walk past, it got me thinking about um, a vlog that I like to do. So I don't know whether this vlog will be inappropriate. Um, I know we can talk about anything when we vlog, but um, there's some things I, I think, should I talk about that or not? I don't know. I mean, I've been watching a programme <coughs> um, on BBC One, for those of out who live outside the United Kingdom, BBC One is uh, one of our leading channels. Um, 
It's, it's called Dead Good Job. And that's what it's called, Dead Good Job. And it's all about um, funeral directors, uh, funerals, and how it how it all happens, what happens, and all this sort of stuff. And I find it fascinating. I really do. Do I know her? I think I know her. No, I don't. Sorry. <laughs> I was about to embarrass myself and, and toot at that, at that lady. Um, yes, it's a very interesting programme. Um, I know for some people it could be uh, a not very nice thing to talk about. Oh, there's my friend on the bus. He doesn't know who I am, but I know him. <laughs> um, what's the sign? Oh shit, I've forgotten. Um, oh yeah. Um, I mean, I've lost loved ones that are dear to me as well. And and I just, whoop. I just sort of think, should I do a vlog about it or not? Well, I think we all need to talk about death. Um, not because we ride motorcycles or anything like that, because it can happen to it. It can happen any time. Not necessarily... Um, oh yes, I mean, the, for motorcyclists, we've got a very high percentage of death and injury. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I, I spoke to this, spoke about this subject to a, uh, to a friend of mine. And basically he just said, you know, when I'm gone, that's it. Shove me in a box in the fire. And it doesn't matter what happens afterwards, because I won't be there. I thought, oh, okay. <laughs> Um, so, I don't know, I don't know, I, I think, is it tradition, shit, is it tradition that we have a funeral, we have to have it a certain way, um, you yeah, know, would it upset people if it was slightly different, I mean, my, my dad was all about funerals and what he wants and stuff, because he's like 60 mid-60s, I say, and, um, but Dad, I have to talk about this, he said, yeah, because I want what I want, and all this sort of stuff, I thought, oh, okay, but I think it's good to talk about it, to your loved ones, to say what you want, and, um, and after all, it's part of the grieving progress, um, part of the grieving process um, and we all grieve in different ways I mean I've had my fair share of grief uh, um, so I'm not an expert but I know how it could feel and you know and it's um, quite a delicate subject um, we've all got different ways of dealing with it um, but it's, it's going to happen to every one of us, but it's the people that get left behind to do with all the arrangements. Um, you know, it's just a part of life. It's a circle of life, as uh, Elton John was saying. It's a circle of life. But you get what I mean. Um, I mean, I quite often think about things like this because I'm quite morbid I'm quite I quite like depressing things but that's just me uh, is it a thing that we should all talk about I don't know but I just thought I might throw it out there if you're gonna you know take a chance not take a chance <laughs> take a chance on me da, 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 da. there's that man again that man took a photograph of me I want to go back the other way just to annoy him for those who didn't see it, it's a little, um, little uh, Japanese man. Oh shit. Three point turn. There we go, but watch that. He's taking another photograph. There he is, look. <laughs> he took a photograph of me, thank you all. It makes me feel happy. <laughs> makes you actually feel happy for what I've got in this, this life. Cause a lot of times we take things for granted that we're, um, you know, uh, happy, healthy, 
and there are some people that are a lot worse, far worse off than us when you think about your problems and <coughs> oh sorry got a bit of a <coughs> going on oh hello they're cutting the grass where are you going okay um Yeah, we look at our lives and we think, oh, it can't get any better, oh, it can't get any worse, no. But you think of someone else's life, it's far worse off than yours. And when you sort of, well, when I, sorry, when I think about funerals and depressing things, I think, no. Cheer up your old bugger. And always look on the bright side of life. If we get a chance to watch the programme, it's called Dead, Dead Good Job. And it's all sorts of funerals and stuff. Um, there's even a, um, a biker with a hearse as a, a sidecar. Which, <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to go in that. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, that's about a choice, isn't it? If it makes the family happy that have been left behind, then it's over enough. Good. Have a good old send off. So, oh my god, what's happening here? I might tell him I'm here. You ever find yourself doing this? You find a learner or a similar sort of style of bike and you chase them. Yeah! Okay, that's enough for me. Chips125CC is signing off for today. Remember, stay tuned, stay cool, and ride safe, but don't swallow moths. <laughs>